Yo, man. What, what, what? Get me away, huh? We're live! Again. Yeah, it's true. And today we're going to be doing some Star Citizen. I'm going to check out the new thing. I've got it on a brand new mate. This is this is this 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 should be a life-changing stream. I'm not trying to overhype it. Totally not hype. I'm totally not overhyping this. But all I'm going to say is I'm switching over now. Okay. Star Citizen allow. Look, it needs to be going through the firewall again. Right. Welcome back, everybody. This is Star Citizen. Today we're running it on a brand new SSD. Da -da 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 -da. Well, it's just a brand new SSD. And oh my God, the loading times. Oh, I do. Okay, so it took seconds. So yes, yes, Windows 10 has screwed my SSD confirmed. Uh, the reason for the loading times in the last video was must have been a faulty SSD. Everyone thought it was an HDD, but it wasn't. It was just an incredibly slow one by the looks of it. Because it is an SSD. It's just clearly not a very good one. So I'm going to say cheap SSDs will not help you. Um, especially if you're running Windows off of that SSD. I'm not running Windows on this SSD. It only has Star Citizen on it. Now, I have a little bit of a sort of problem with that because you shouldn't need to buy dedicated hardware for one game. You know, buying a GPU is different because yeah. all games require a GPU. But if we're getting now into this... Require a new drive too. Yeah, now games require SSD, so that's fun. I think I need to do the volume again for this game. Just a sec. We're going to lose a little bit of ambience. Yeah, it's gone to full volume because, of course, it's a new install. Right then, there we go. Boom. So... Oh, and the music's gone. The stream looks awesome. There we go. Music started again. Right. So let's load the universe. Here we go. Something tells me it's going to take seconds. Whoa. I've, I'm, I've, I've gone trans race again. It's forgotten what I look like. Trans race? <coughs> yeah, yeah. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a white guy. Because I'm a white guy, white guy. And I've got a pompadour, pompadour. And my hair's black because I dye it. Look at this guy. Hi, guys. <laughs> Seriously, though, what other faces do... Oh, my God, that's the best face. Wait, now that doesn't... Why Why does... I can't get... Why doesn't that look right? Anyway, let's just have a look at the other faces here. Is that... Oh, my God. Oh, my days. Wow, the choices. Look at this one, Mon. Do you like this one? Or this one? Oh. Yeah, I know. No. Yeah, they're not locked to the colour. Neanderthal watch. It kind of looks weird. Hey, that's that's racist. You can't say that. Um, no, it's taxidermist. Taxidermist. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, that's, that's forensic. Racism. What? Right, I'm going to be that guy because that's who I was last time. And I want to trigger people with my character selection. Okay, here we go. Yellow and hair. go. It's going to be instant now. Yeah, so it turns out if you have Windows on an SSD and that SSD is more than half full, you can forget any performance increase. Not so something... just buy a huge SSD. Yeah, not, like not something... No, no, don't do that. Don't do that. You can still use a large, normal hard drive for your games, because most games don't need this, okay, to make them work. But clearly, this game needs it to work. So, you, what you do is you buy a 100 gig, which is what I did, you get like a 120 gigabyte SSD, which is quite cheap, okay, but don't put, don't put Windows on it. Only put Star Citizen, and maybe if you've got room for other games that have this issue. Apparently, there's a whole bunch of them. Allegedly, racing games are affected by this, but I don't know. I've played Project Cars, Project Cars 2, Dirt Rally. None of them seem to be affected by this, but whatever, you know. Uh, mind you, it is still loading. It should finish loading any second now, because, I mean, look, 
It took five minutes for the first loading screen before and it took seconds. So yeah. I'm expecting this to take like, oh, crash. Ah, gutted me. Okay, so, um. Is it funny not enough? First egg, no. Uh, relaunch. Okay, so it just crashed. Uh, see, see, I'm sold on it. It was my hard drive that was causing the slowness. But that doesn't excuse all the crashes. That did happen in the in the other stream. It crashed like. But it's an alpha early progress. Maybe, maybe you need to crash once to get it to run right. So let's just go straight in. Crashed. Look, go to last instance. I wasn't in an instance, mate. It never loaded. There's no point. Next. Okay, let's. We're on round two. Round two, everyone. Round two. Round two. Loading the game. You know, it could be best of three. We'll find out. What I don't get is this is a huge game with tons of artists, right? Loads of assets. And they only have one loading screen. No, there's two. It, they have two loading screens. Yeah, I know. Screens. It switches to a different it's loading screen. Yeah, I know. You would think that they could get a few more fancy photo, fa fancy screenshots, you know? Maybe they'll do like a screenshot competition. An hour photoshopping the screenshots. Maybe they'll know. just get uh, get the players to do it, you know? <laughs> now that would be epic fail. Loading Folded bot. Folded bot. The stream has gone live. Wait, what? Lol, the screenshot changes. Ah, we're in. We're in. Right, we're in. Do you want to go to your last instance? No. Come link established. Let's get out of bed. It is H to get out of bed, not M. I was pressing H before, but someone commented it. W I was pushing the wrong key, but then they deleted their comments. So I don't know. Whatever. Okay. Now there's a couple of things that I want to do today. The first is I want to see if this joystick's going to work. Oh my God! The door just works. They fixed it. They fixed it. Nice. When you go up to the door, it actually just. Oh, you can't go back in there then. Whatever. But it, it worked when I tried to get out. I don't know if you're allowed, supposed to get back in. Okay. Parkour, parkour. Yeah, you can still jump over there. But my immersion! Uh, F4. I wanna go back to my bunk right. to oh my god, look, look. I can, I can run around now. And it's not like... Being retarded. I love it. Yes, the flame is burning! With the power to defeat you! And it's not Jake and... Ah, oh, mate. Do you know what? This is like night and day. It's gone back to how it was in 2.8 for me. It's just weird that uh, between 2.8 and 3.0, everything went to shit. Um, it was with the worst of games. Where's my ship at? Did he say platform? Which platform did he say? Oh, it's over here. It's really inconsistent, that. Uh, that's landing pad 10. So I'm guessing it must be on pad four. I didn't really see the number. Yeah, it should write it out on your UI. And eh? you know what? Before I go anywhere, I want a bloody gun because it robbed me of all my weapons last time I played. Hi, welcome. Yeah, hi. Where's oh, all no. my guns? Give me my guns. Got some new inventory in. Definitely worth taking a look. Yeah. Okay. All right, I've got a problem, lady. Why is it that my guns are in my pocket, but I can't use, look, empty, yeah? Primary weapon empty, huh? What, why? Look, I've got a, an arc light energy pistol, available zero, in use one. And then I've got an LH-86 ballistic pistol. So if I is say I want that anything one. I can help you with? And that's now available, okay. So where's my primary weapon gone? I should have like an SMG, I should have a shotgun, all sorts of stuff. So we'll take the spare weapon. Look, look, here we go. In all instances of this item are equipped elsewhere. Please choose a location to transfer this item from. No idea what that's got to, what is, what are they talking about? 
no idea, mate. Maybe it's on a different instance. You left it somewhere. Yeah, but that's the thing. I don't have a different we instance. A Look, variety. see. Take your time. Unequip. It won't. See this this thing here? It won't. Yeah, I do. Crash. 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 Crashed again. Don't have no main weapon. Right, okay, okay, guys, we're going to relaunch, and this time I won't go anywhere near the guns, so we can't do guns. Why? All of this strong with this one. Like, why, 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 why does the game crash when I try to equip a gun? Look, I, I look. I realise that when you've got a lot of features in your game, it takes a long time to test everything to make sure that the current build you're about to push out doesn't actually actually really? works. Yeah, but like, okay, I did actually press the button to join the instance, but it hasn't done anything, so that I won't do that again. See, I'm I'm learning. I, the game's teaching me. The game is teaching me not. <laughs> By it's, crashing. Yeah, it's teaching me not to try, uh, not to expect it to run first time. It's taught me not to try and buy any weapons or armor because that fucks up too. Excuse my French. Like, because the lot when I tried to buy armor, it wasted my money on an undersuit that I didn't click on, and then I had to go back and didn't have enough money to purchase the armor suit, which I actually already have. Because if you look at my Kickstarter rewards, I should have a. I should have a pistol. I should have a full armor suit. I should have an arf, an, a rifle. I should have. How I should have all this. All I should have all this stuff on my account already, but none of it's there. It used to be there. Maybe you have to claim it. Somewhere? Well, I already did claim it, but every time they re what do I have to reclaim my stuff every patch? Because that's like so yeah, but weird. dude, does they bring out a new patch every couple of days? At least they're still working on it, is all I'm going to say. But... Many people don't play it, even. Look at this, though. It's, it's, it's smooth now. Before, it was a slideshow. It's actually smooth now. So, brand new SSD with nothing else on it. Good to go. I do think that's a little bit like having a disability ramp put in to stop you tripping on your way up the stairs. But, whatever, man. <laughs> as, as long as it, it does it. Hey, look, we found another player. And he's running. Why are you running? Oh, he hasn't been here before either because this is a dead end. All right, let's go. Hardcore parkour. Parker, hardcore parkour. So now I've got to look my ship, right? My ship. Ah, oh, now this is another thing that annoys me, right? <coughs> The game crashed before I got in my ship, right? So guess what? Maybe it's a random crash. Oh no, it's okay. I can just retrieve it. Normally I had to pay money for that. Jesus. Landing pad 7. Let's go. Um... For some reason, I can't see the indicator on my HUD. Maybe it's not actually there yet. Uh, landing pad 7 is down here. Right. So essentially, guys, we're going to try and do like something. It, I'm really annoyed that... Um, well, I'm just annoyed, aren't I? Have I got my money back at least? If they're going to take my stuff away, are they giving me the money back again? Yeah, they have. Right, okay. Do you know what? We're going to test something else before we leave the station. I like the notion of not giving you all those markers, but they did. It would be nice to be able to... There we go. I can see my marker now. Can we open the door? Whoa! Oh, this is still buggy. Right. Don't worry, guys. We're going to figure this out. Yeah, we're in. Hi. Thanks for coming in. Mate, doors are hard, all right? I understand. Doors are hard. Yeah. They are. Right, now, if you see this, look. It wants me to buy everything separately. And look, arms. I can't select the legs, I oh guess. Okay, so, buy. Confirm purchase. 2,000 credits. I only start with... Can we equip now? 
Purchase complete. Equip now. Never mind. Let's buy the next bit. I'm going to buy the buy the arms next. No. Buy the helmet. Uh, oh no, the helmet's 2,000, dude. So you start with 5k, so all I can buy is the helmet and the chest piece. <laughs> well, that's your main. Okay. Like, before I had, like, guns on my ship and all sorts. So the legs are a thousand. But I will have tiny little wimpy arms. Work, mate. Work, 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 work. No, I've got it, I've got it. Hang on. I'm going to buy the arms and not the legs. So basically it'll just look like I skipped leg day. <laughs> Hang on. I need to put on my, uh, I need to put my armor on. This is going to look silly. If it works, it's never worked properly. I want it to. Come on. Okay, Mark X helmet. It hasn't actually updated in the preview, but that's... Oh, wait, has it? Oh, no, it did. So that's what I was wearing before. Why are you always looking over there? There we go. Look at that thing. It's like an egg. It's like I have my head in an egg. Okay, and we're going to put the Mark X. There we go. Because you need this, because it's got all the uh, RCS is built into this suit. So if you try and go outside oh. your ship with just the space suit, the flight suit on, you're, you float. you're stuffed, mate. Yeah. You float. I there we go. go. I skipped leg day. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Done. What? Well, come on, crossfade animation. There we go. Right. Okay, so this is this is me now. Yeah, you have. Well, did you know what? It didn't crash. And also, I'm liking all this stuff. Look. It might have been a random loading crash, like loading background assets. Should we try it again then? Weapons are yeah. only over here. I mean, hey, it doesn't take long to reload now, so I'm like not so bothered about it crashing really. So what's all this? What's all this? What's that? Magazine. Yeah, this is what stopped me packs. playing KSP. Right. Because it loads like in an hour. Oh god, that's not good. Maybe yeah, you should be running it on an SSD. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, if I had one. Right. What's that? An energy shotgun. I don't want an energy shotgun. Shotgun, 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 shotgun. They're all shotguns. How well, about... They are shooting and they are guns. How about... I don't think I've actually got any money, though, so... Ballistics SMG. And it'll say, You've got no money! Uh... Alright, fine. Whatevers. Okay, so... Ship... Ship, 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 where are you? All right, let's go. I know where it is. I know where it is. On A07. Please, Mr. Domino, get to A07 platform and take away your ship. Mr. Oh, Mr. Tom. That should be a sa sample from Fallout. Mr. Tom. Right, so... Pad 7, wasn't it? Confirm. Let's go. There's my beautiful ship. Okay, so much lens flare. Such. Wow. Open it up. Gloom is not gloom. Mm. Oh look, there's someone over there in another ship. We've just loaded in. Well, still a bit oh, weird. Yeah. It's still a bit weird with this. This is all a bit weird. They've, what they've done is they've changed the mouse speed so that when you're near something, it's like more, or sorry, less DPI. But then what happens is you compensate oh. for it and go past it. Yeah, I see. <laughs> so it's like really difficult. You've got like sticky mouse going out. Right. Okay, so there's the ship. Now I need to. Re I don't remember how to do the advanced camera, so I'm gonna have to look that up quick. Learn it. Yeah, uh, yeah. I can Well, I can't remember. It's been so long. I left the game alone for a long time. 
So no, we don't want that. We want advanced camera controls. Because uh, this, look, it just says F4, cycle camera view. Um, but I know there's oh, more no, I to like it. this UI design. Yeah, the UI is pretty good. Not going to lie. No, I mean the keyboard layout thingy. Ah, uh, here we go. Advanced camera. Right. Right, so hold F4 and hold Z. And then you have to hold F4 and numpad and you can save the view to a numpad number. So you can save angles. Um, left arrow, right arrow, up arrow. So you've got to hold F4 and then move the camera with the arrow keys. Page up, page down, numpad. How do you rotate though? Spectator free cam, no. See, I've seen people rotating the view in external camera mode, but I can't find any way to... Look, do you know, see what I mean? Look, you got X offset plus X. So you got X and... Yeah. X, Y, Z. FOV, depth of field, and that's it. So where is yeah, why, the... Why need more? Well, where's rotate? X, Y, Z. No, this is moving in. This is translation. Isn't oh, that here, I'll show you. I'll show you. I'll show you. Look, look, look. We're in the game, so we don't need to talk about it. Hold F4. Yeah. Left, right, forward, back. Where's page up and page up? Up and down. Up, down, left, right, forward, back. Yeah. But where's rotate? And you say why? Well, I'll show you. How do I look at my ship? How do I mouse? Nope. Mouse doesn't do anything. Joystick doesn't do anything. Wait. Ah, hang on. What's hold Z do? Ha ha! Yes! Right, let's set up some angles then. Okay. And a Z. So let's set up some angles. So this can be... Buy our free game angles! Oh, don't, don't, no, no. We can't plug it during the session. That's a bit uh, uncouth. Oh, so, just... It's all right, it's all right. So F2 can be that. Did that work? So if I press numpad 2, ah, uh, numlock. Ah, right. My bad. Okay, so Z, rotate, look down, and then hold F and go back and up, and then hold Z and look down. And then hold F and go back and down, down, down. So then we've got the ship in the middle of the screen. A little bit to the left. We'll get the angle just right, like that. And then now, hold F4 and 2. Okay, now if I push... Yeah, okay, so then how do we reset it then? Uh... Z, no. See, I just did it by accident. Hmm. Um. Hmm. Okay, so I've got to return. I thought there was a camera reset button. Hang on. I need the reset. Maybe Otherwise, I'll have to use... Maybe just that's default number. Yeah, yeah. Default. Well, I could just use number one. Yeah. Hmm. But I swear there was a reset. Let's have a look. Probably. Yeah, reset current view is numpad star. Okay, so numpad star. Numpad star. Oh. That doesn't... That Does doesn't work? No. Doesn't do nothing. I wonder. With numpad lock on or off. So I just, I guess I'll have to just sort of Adjure. figure it out myself. So I'll just move it myself. It's fine. So you gotta look forward like that. It's probably gonna end up being a bit better anyway. Just gotta chase cam. A bit like that. Forward and down, 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 and up. like that. And we'll call that one number one. Oh wait, it just did it. What? Yeah. Funny. Huh. 
Oh, there we go. Nice, I can switch between them. Ooh. That's weird, though. I have to hold F4 and then press 2. But I thought that was how you saved the views. So what have they done oh, there? Let's have another quick look-see. Key bindings, advance, camera. Right. Save view is numpad 1. Load view is numpad 1. See what I'm talking about, mate? Yeah, you ex. Like, so I thought you have to hold F4 to save the view as numpad 1. And then you just press the view. Look, clear saved view, numpad 0. So maybe, do you have to hold the button to set it? Do you have to hold the button? To, it used to be combination to save, just the button to load. But now it's combination to load. So let's try something here. So if I just push 3 and then go F4, you can one, customize it. F4 3. What the? F4 4. F4, two, F4, F4, two, one. Because I'd like to have one which is like, you know, in front of the ship as well. Oh boy. He's looking at me. What do you I, didn't, want? I didn't do nothing. I'm just sitting here. Right, I want one that's like, you know, looking at the front of the ship. That'll do, and then let's pull back and up a bit. No, up a bit, a little to the left. And then look like that, maybe. And then, right, okay, so how do we do this? Do we press, hold F4 and press three and hold it? And then we can do this. Oh yeah, that's good, that's good. All right, so now I've got a side view and I've got a front view. What else do I need? I think that'll do for today. I'll come up with some more stuff. Next thing is, does this joystick do anything in this game? That's another thing I need to check out. Can you do joystick controls? Flight movement. Flight movement, yes pitch and yaw. Is this just to invert things? It is. This is just to invert things, so no. Hmm. What? Maybe it doesn't have... Oh, here we go. Virtual joystick mode. Virtual signaling? But this is all inversion settings. You can... Look, you can edit the curves. That's a plus. And there's virtual joysticks in the game, but it's all mouse. So, hang on, uh, advanced controls. Ah. Oh, there we go, joystick. Right. Wait, so is that all I needed to do? I don't know. Oh wait. Down, up, left, right. Don't know if roll works. Only thing is, I don't think it understands my throttle input. That's weird. You can do aim. Oh, is that is that the F key? Oh my goodness, it is. This is this is interact with joystick. All right. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Trigger didn't trigger. Oh my god. Oh, there we go. Trigger triggered. Right, I'm going to have to use the mouse. I'm just going to have to use both because it's just a bit weird. Whoops. Turn the engine on, please. I'd love to know where the fuel gauge is too, because I've never actually managed to find the fuel gauge. There's so many gauges. Ah! Don't know where it is, mate. Which one's fuel? Nobody knows. Nobody can tell me. Look, your fuel Maybe is low. Or something. 
Yeah, it says my fuel is low. Oh no, don't boost. That's not something we want to do on the landing pad. Right. QF maybe? What? Wait, well, I, wait, wait, I wait. thought it might be this. Because look, it says, it says usage. Oh God, it's UI. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I'm trying to force it to go up and it won't go up. There we go. Right, items, rush, yeah, zap jet. EMIR is your signature. Oh, I know what that is. The usage is either fuel or heat. Yeah, but it, which which is it though? Because I don't look. This number changes, and I can, whoops, I can drag this down. See, and if but I drag that, power usage, yeah. Power but if I drag, yeah. But if I drag power usage down to there, I'm in my stealth bracket, yeah. Yeah. Well. Your EM heat and IR goes down, yeah. Yeah. But, like, I, I've i never really used that, so I'll leave it alone. Um, how about the one panel to the right, uh, I mean to the left? See, there. I can click stealth and it will just do it, right? Uh, the panel to the left. Okay. Got suppress overall IR. Right, and then turn that off, and uh, everything goes up, but not really because I'm not really doing anything. Okay, then Items. this is just your signature panel. Yeah, yeah, it's signature. Uh, Look, I can change the weapons. Look, uh, weapons. So wait, see, we got power, which is the one next to us. Shields, which is the other one. Weapons, heat. Oh, so you can customize it. Comms. Okay. Yeah, so you can change it. What was there before? I've forgotten what was there before. Was it that? Was it weapons was there before? It was heat on the left and power on the second left. It was heat. Yeah, it was. Um, but like I say, I've got... Look, you can see all of the different screens. It's pretty much... I don't know, I just... Oh wait, up, up... Top right? Uh, no, that's still your signature. Yeah. So I, I don't really know... Bottom somewhere, maybe? I, I, I can't see any other uh, fuel gauges. Oh wait, is that it? The QF? Quantum fuel, maybe? Maybe, yeah. But they said it was hydrogen I need. Um, it's just bizarre. Weird. Yeah, like, make you up your minds. Up? Yeah, please do. Because I can't. Name? Well, it doesn't matter what ship it is. Oh, well, yeah, I suppose it does, actually. Um, it's a Reliant. Okay, right. Well, let's take off anyway. Oh yeah, that's right. The engine switched off. Engine on. Engine's off. Engine's on. What? Bucky Hydrogen dead. fuel is the bottom gauge on the left of the hub. There are two gauges stacked vertically. One, the top one is your throttle, and the bottom one is your boost AB fuel. Wait. So roll is that? And this is just turn. That's weird, man. Why is Yolen that? Roll. Yeah, it's the opposite way around. You're in roll. I suggest been... uh, getting farther from your landing pad. Maybe somebody spawns there or something. Okay. At least the throttle gauge is working. Seems like. Use eight to use the afterburners. Okay. Terran Ascension particle mounts conf confirmed. <laughs> Need to get that rotation, brah. Right, so let's get in the air. Yeah. Uh, let's see. So we should be at zero speed now, unless it's going to try going backwards. Nope. Oh, yeah. So when you see the 100, that's your normal fuel gauge. 
Where right. you see your zero fifty, that's that's what? Wait, where I see what? One hundred? What one hundred? Yeah, that's supposed to be a fuel gauge. Wait, but why is it telling me that I've got like no fuel all the time? It must be a bug. It's a bug, isn't it? Could it? Be, yeah. It's a bug. Ignore it. Okay, so F two. Let's open the quantum star map and get rammed by some player. Here he comes. Uh, let's go to Daymar. Because Daymar's so the hydrogen planet. is 100 on your ship. Okay. Daymar, please. Where's Daymar? Is that it? Woo. Hang on a sec. It's a bit. There we go. Daymar. Daymar. Whoa. That'll do. All right. Let's go full throttle and boost and afterburner. Boost afterburner. Doesn't get any quicker than that, right? All the way up to 11k and then. Let go. Now, okay. will that just stay there or no? No, it actually. Okay. So the throttle setting is not free on this, on I my, on keyboard. Whoa, it's slowed down, look. It's actually slowed down. Interesting. I'm not, by the way, flying all the way there. I'm not stupid. Um, no, 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 no. I wanted to do it's some fine, of this. I wanted to do some of this, like, this is where we set up the cameras. Ta-da! Even though we've got weird thrusters that are pointing the wrong way it's fine there we go actually got some interesting angles and i can just hold z and we can modify them and have a little look around now nice so yeah it's, it's a very, it's a very pretty game but you've got to like set it all up yeah it's usually the case of simulators yeah there's the station in the background. So let's go. Quantum travel, Quantum travel mate. Ooh. Do you have to use your hand for that? Nope. Yay. They got rid of that stupidity. Oh, and we're there. The STD effect of travel. Mm hmm. And we're here now. What are those thrusters firing down for? Yeah, well, what about the RCSs that are nowhere near the ship? <laughs> yeah, I know. It's just a bug, isn't it? The mounting point for the particle effects, oh, the socket okay. hasn't oh, moved with the ship. Yeah. Basically, the sockets are being positioned absolutely to the core rather than um, as, a ch as, a child, uh, as a child to the... Yeah, they're not actually attached to the wings. They're just in a grid space off the main but the lights are I know which is why I'm like why didn't they just put them on there then right. whatever man I've never used lumberyard I don't know uh, so what the hell is on five and why is it on the other side of the planet Contact received. <laughs> okay so f2 here's me little me Contact received. Oh my God. come on Matt don't break on me now Whoa, did I just see a planet, like, really far away? Delamar? I I've never seen that there before. It's, like, really far out. What the hell is Delamar? A new world! Right? Hmm, Delamar. Let's go Maybe Delamar! I've never been it. there before. It's really far away, mate. Do you have the fuel? I did probably not. <laughs> Who cares? Do they have fuel rats in this game? Mm, I really don't think there's that. It's that advanced yet. Um, so is it obstructed? Is that where? I, is it? I can't go to Delamar. No. Maybe it's blocked. No, no. Wait, no. That's nothing to do with me either. So yeah. No, none of that is a thing. I can't go there. I've got to go somewhere else first. So. Uh, I 
always thought that was silly how you can't warp you can only warp in a straight line like yeah you don't yeah, think people uh, could do a curve in their warp i gotta go for half an hour but it's all good mate then. i'll see you soon enjoy your trip well well if if yeah <laughs> if it doesn't crash anymore right right investigation we're gonna accept this mission Someone was killed on an, a Starfarer. Tristar Private Intelligence is looking for the contractors. I need to go to a wreck site. Okay, so where is where is that going to be? Where is that going to be? Uh, oh, it looks like Delamar is where I need to go for this. Derelict site, Delamar. Right, okay. So, how do I get there is the question. It's through the, the planet, so I need to what, go around it? Yeah. Do, 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 do. Can I have the map though? Thank you. So if I'm at Daymar, I guess I have to go to the comm station first. And then reroute. Okay. No. Nope. God, that's weird. I need to change that. I need to change that. Whoa, whoa. I don't want to see all this stuff. What's all that stuff? What the hell? Anyway, yeah, no. Hmm. Hang on a minute. Stop right now. F4. Thingy. N. No. N. Uh huh. Wait, is this literally telling me where other players are trying to jump to? Well, that's a little bit. That's a little bit hacky. You could get intel on what people are doing like you're a god. What? It literally says someone called Farrister is trying to jump and can't somewhere. I don't know, I don't care. Right, because it even has the name of the station. Y y Yella. Trying to jump, sky. F so lots of stuff's going on right now. Okay. Oi! Stop it! Stupid thing. It's trying to take input from the mouse that I'm not touching. Right. F4. And then F2. And that's right. We were in the middle of trying to do a jump. My God! Is that the place I'm going? No, it's not. It's not even a thing. It's just my freaking crosshair. Okay, I really don't... That's what I was doing. I was changing the control setup because I really don't like this. Like, they've made... They've made joystick... T like, you turn the joystick to the left or the right is turn left and right. And then the twisting the joystick makes it roll. Which is completely bastardized. That's not how planes or whatever, it's not how you do it. So I need to change that. Where are we? So we go to... Yeah, look. Pitch your roll. But they don't mention it's not necessarily in that order. Okay, so how difficult is it going to be to fix this? <coughs> Joystick, roll and war, your swap. Joystick. Joystick. Did that fix it? Oh, look. There's even a setting that just does exactly what I wanted. Thank you very much. I like that. 
It's a little bit oversensitive though, blimey. Like I'm that's the slightest little zero 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 one. Oh god, you gotta be super super gentle. Oh, that's too much. Right, let's go. Enough jibber jabber. And then immediately route to. Oh my goodness, why is that so bright now? The star was never that bright. Whoa, there's like even more stuff. There's Hurston and Stanton and. Ark Corp. I don't know. I'm just trying to get to where I'm trying to get to. Right. Quantum Beacon, it says. Okay, let's do it. Set as destination. Alrighty. Now, where's my marker? Okay, let's go. Quantum travel engaged. What's going on? Am I getting wrecked here? Oh, I've been pulled out of war. Right, okay. Time to leave. Just need to get round this big rock. And quantum drive again. No, no quantum drive for me. Okay. Let's go faster. Yeah, can we do it now? They must have had some kind of interdiction. Don't know. But whatever, I didn't get shot, so that's cool. Oh, am I getting pulled out of warp again? What for this time? More rocks? No, no more rocks. Faster, please. Contact received. Contact received. Okay, where are this? Where's the contact? Do I have to look behind me? What's going on here? Hmm. Don't know. No one's taken any poppy shots. So. Oh yeah, there was something I wanted to find out. If I turn the engine off now, so I'm going full speed, engine off. I should just keep glowing, just keep going forever. But have a very, very, very low signature. So let's see, F. Okay, I want stealth and suppress. Anything else I need to click to stealth it up? Yeah, stealth. Anything else? No, that should be it. And I'm still just doing full speed. Huh. Well, I don't know if that's going to be useful, but it certainly feels like it should be useful. I mean, I've still got a signature, but it's just very low. I don't know if the floor changes, like if that 1212 is actually quite high, but it's just showing at the bottom because it can go higher. I don't know. So it's not like I've got no signal. I've just got a low signal. So anyway, let's put everything back on. Um, or I'll leave it actually in stealth. Engines off. Engines on. Keep it in stealth. Oh, it's slowing down now. Okay, whatever. No power. 
<laughs> you need the power to actually warp. I like it. So you can't just cheese the stealth mode. All right, so let's try turning this off first. And then jump. Still no power. So it's, that isn't the power then. I'm still learning. The, or I've never messed with any of these buttons. See, what's that all about? On and off. Off. Oh, so I've got one gun, and when it's switched on, it uses power. Gotcha. Okay, so let's take... Ah. 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 It's been done. Just turned a whole ship off by hitting that button. Uh, okay, so, you know, if there's a button for stealth, you would think there'd be a toggle for turning the stealth off again. But it looks like I've actually got to click on these tiny little things and drag them up again. But that's okay. Learning curves. Quantum travel engaged. And off we go. So I can see the top of the bar is 28.73 and 33.75. So it has tripled the signal. I'm guessing bigger ships, you get bigger signal maxes. Here we are again. We made it to the derelict site, so let's find out what the deal is, shall we? 10 kilometers. I wonder if there's any friendlies here. is a bit weird. Landing gear down. Do I have to land on that thing? You're too close, they said. I... What the... Okay, stop the boat. Stop the boat! Alright. F. Let's put it in park and go and check it out. Engines off. Off. Power off. Weapon. And then... Open exterior and... Get out. Okay. Do I get a gun today? I get a pistol. Alright then, guys. We're going to disembark. Oh, come on, EVA. You can do this. Okay, so where do I have to go? There's a couple of player ships here. I don't know if they're... You know, being. I don't know if there are. Uh, those people are here, but whatever, their ships are here. Hello, I can see a player out there, I think. So, what have I actually got to do? So, there's my ship. There's. Levski, whatever that means. Wait a minute, what the hell? I thought I was supposed to be doing a mission. This is one of those things about this game. The marker's gone. Where do I go? <laughs> That's not what I wanted. Where do I go, man? What are you doing, menu? Come on. Updated contract manager? No, that's not it. It'd be nice if a little, like, little, t little mouse over so you know what you're clicking on because uh, these icons are meaningless. Like ship, person, star, letters, round thing. 
Spanner. Letters. Friends? I, don't, I really don't know. Whenever I click on anything. So what's going on here then? Investigation. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, what? So where's, where's, where's the mission I've already accepted? Here it is. Starfarer. Locate the missing crew. I've got to locate loads of people. Untrack. Track. Okay. Right. So you'd think... This is the derelict site, or a derelict site. Am I, am I come to the wrong place? I can't really tell if it's a Starfarer or not, because the lighting here is so bad, and the planet, look, whatever this is, this asteroid, it looks like garbage. I can't even see, even with my torch. I don't know what's going on. Was this a Starfarer? I don't know. Your guess is as good as mine. I guess it might be. Oh, 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 what's this? Um. Hi. So there's there's a person here. I don't know what we're doing here, man. This is really bizarre. Wait, there's a floating is that a data pad? Or is it just a floating thing? I have no idea. But there's nothing to interact with here. Nothing at all. Um, hmm. Ow! What the? Oh, that's annoying. Wait, what? He just collected something? Where'd you find that, bro? What the hell? And now he's taking it to his ship. Look, there's a ship over there parked up. What the hell is it telling me to do my mouse? Zoom in. I guess you can get a scope for that. So that guy's collecting stuff. I've got to go back to my ship because I'm running out of tank. Is that oxygen? I've got no idea what you're supposed to do here. What a mess. Um, the, the, the mission says I've got to find a bunch of dead people or something. Or I've got to find people. Like an entire crew. Um, but to be honest, I can't see shit over there, and it's getting really annoying. <laughs> I'll just do something else. Look, that light is not, it's just doing nothing out there. Uh, what's going on? Oh, I just fell flat on my face, getting in. It's that anti-grav generator. So allegedly there was stuff to do over there, but I I don't know what it was supposed to be. Okay. It's kind of annoying. Right, so F2. Right, I never knew there was stuff even further away. What's this? Arc Corp. What? I take it Stanton is the star. 
We've got Hearst and an Arc Corp. Yeah, let's do that. Never been there. Wait, what? Select an entity for additional details. Arc Corp. I didn't even know there was anything out there. Oh boy. Right then. Engine on. Oh, we flight ready. And that engine on. Engine on. So, okay, so we flew out here to try and find out what the heck's going on here. We found a wreck. Um, but it's not a wreck of the. It's not the right type of ship, so I'm I'm guessing that I'm at the wrong wreck, and I need to go home and rethink my life. Come on, move. There we go. So we're going to go to a different planet that I didn't even know exists, uh, and that planet is this way. So. Wait a minute, what? Did it just say out of range? No way, this thing has a range? That's news to me. So it looks like we're not going there then, because it's too far away and I'm a noob. You can't fly there. What about that one, Hurston? Is that out of range? Let's find out. God, this thing's oversensitive. I need to, like, turn all of the joystick settings down. Okay, that's not the thing I selected. That's just this derelict site again. Yeah, we have some issues here. Wait. Oh, look at that. This one's out of range, too. All right, so we've established we can't go that far. So we've got to go to Crusader. Can we like move around this map? Yes. Whoa! No. What the? Crusader, yeah? Should we go there, yeah? Yeah, let's go there. God damn it. This thing. Right, we've never been to Daymar either, so let's go there. I, got, I should be able to get there at least, because I came from that direction. Where are you going? Hey? How is it going? I'm on Star Citizen. I put it on a brand new SSD um, to end the argument. All I can say is I recommend a new SSD without Windows installed on it. You know? Are we nah. going to go? Yes, we're jumping to Daymar. Take a look on the stream. You'll see what I'm doing. Hello, Mr. Devin. Hi. Hello. Hi, Tim. How's it going, dude? My voice. Your voice sounds messed up, like Gollum. Gollum, Gollum. I'm just jumping to Hi. Daymar in Star Citizen. What? I'm jumping to Daymar in Star Citizen. Uh, I don't like. I don't. Really most like people, it. most people don't. It's not finished. <laughs> uh, Star Citizen in general. Whoa! Stop it! Stop it! The game just look, look. Did you see that? If you were watching the stream, you would have seen a common bug there. As it jumps... I wasn't watching your stream. As it... Well, you don't need to say that on the stream, but thank you for that. So basically, um... Yeah, yeah. <laughs> What's it called? What the Je ne sais quoi. What was that? Yeah, I know. As I came out of warp, it made my ship go into an uncontrolled spin, and I had to correct it. That's a common thing, Lord. that is. Yeah, I don't know why it does it. It does it when you go in through the atmosphere as well. It, it seems like they really should work on the RTS. 
Yeah, the RCS is buggy as sin. Also, something else I don't like, which is better in uh, uh, Elite Dangerous. That game, we, okay. that game we should not say at the moment. No, we don't talk about... We don't No, no. You can talk about Elite interest. Dangerous all you like, mate. Conflict I, su you're I playing, said... You're playing no, Dosis. no, mate. See, I'm a consumer... And I paid into Elite Dangerous and Star Citizen, so I get to talk shit about both of them if I want. That's how it works. Yeah, fuck you. Yeah. Well, Just like if someone buys our game, they get to talk shit about our game. That's how it works. Yeah, pay ten pounds to say shit yeah. about us. If you want to talk shit way. about us, it's only only costs ten dollars. <laughs> Can I do it also if I played the demo? Yeah, well, I don't know. It's a demo, so you'll always be met with, yeah, but that's just the demo. <laughs> so, and then, but yeah, if you but buy the game, what? yeah. Out <laughs> yet? Star Citizen isn't out yet, unless you pay yeah. like five grand. Yeah. Elite Dangerous is out. Well, actually, mate, to be honest, they both kickstarted in the same month, and Elite Dangerous has been out for three years. It, so let's not. not the same month. They let's not. On the same year. You know, let's let's not be misleading here. They were kickstarted in the same month. I've got I was I kickstarted them both in the same thirty day period, okay? Elite oh. Dangerous came out on time and we've had it for three years. Star Citizen is still a work in progress. If you want to make your judgment, you know, take it take it take that and sprinkle a lot of salt on it and you've pretty much got every forum argument over these two games ever. So, I I like Star Citizen. I like how it looks. My only issue is with it is... game. Mate, I installed it on an SSD DOM. <laughs> I actually installed. Lies. No, 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 no. I got a new SSD that's only 120 gigabytes out of my off office. Oh, yeah? yeah. I put it in my computer for just this game, and instantly everything did load fine. Huh. So it's so basically, if you have an SSD and it's got Windows on it, and it's more than half full, that's not good enough. You have to have <laughs> an SSD for Star Citizen. Have to have a dedicated SSD Dedicated for SSD, one mate, for one game, yeah. But the Amazing. thing is, when you think about it, if these guys get away with it, all the devs will be doing it, and then you'll need a dedicated SSD for everything. GTA They'll 6... They'll be selling the game with the SSD. Yeah, GTA 6 recommended SSD. <laughs> It's, we're going back to cartridges again. Yeah, we are. So. We are, mate. Yeah, it's fucking. It's a joke. <laughs> I like know. You buy this. You buy this game. You get this SSD with it, and just plug it in and play. Right. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. That's that's what they should do. They should bundle the. They should make games which are an SSD, a, a game on a small SSD, and then you you just plug that into your SATA port, mate. You know. Because then PCs will come out with an external SATA port, right? And then, the case. yeah, and then just get rid of DVD and Blu-ray and all that bollocks and just have SSD SATA port done. Yeah. Yeah. I would say give it five years and it will happen. Yeah, probably. They'll probably have like SATA port SSD on a on a chip, so you just have like a thumb drive. Oh no, that's not a USB, mate. That's a SATA drive. You'd be like, what's the SATA drive? Oh, it's a solid state hard drive the size of a USB stick. Oh, so it's basically the same thing then. Yeah. No. No, uh, it's different tech. No. Uh. <laughs> Please. Oh, by the way, right now I'm gliding into the planet because, like I was saying, the thing about Elite Dangerous that I like over Star Citizen right now is there's no there's no quick travel system once you're inside an area. So, like, I can walk to the planet, or the moon, or the station, I can walk to those beacons, okay, but now I'm going to go down and land on the planet, I have to just fly for about five, ten minutes in a straight line before I even hit the atmosphere, like, that's what I'm doing now. Like, I don't know, if someone wants to comment and tell me I'm a twat, just tell me I'm a twat, and this is how you do it, Tom, and then I'll be grateful to you. Not for calling me a twat, but for telling me how you're supposed to do it, because there's no bloody instructions and it's not obvious. And you can also <laughs> tell me it is obvious and where the instructions are, if you like. And Come on, Tom, it's obvious. 
It's you obvious. Go, mate. Yeah, see, it's obvious, mate. It's obvious, mate. Why are you asking about game features? <laughs> what, are you a new player or something? We don't tell you anything. Uh-oh, I just turned. Oh, that was a huge tutorial. I just turned. Starve it. Oh, what, the tutorial? That... Oh, that <laughs> tutorial. The one that doesn't exist. Uh-oh. We've screwed up the camera angle. There we go. One more thing, a, a game bit. like Star Citizen would have a tutorial. Or is a tutorial up to date? Right, now that the atmosphere isn't burning my ship, do you think I should slow down a bit? Now, nah, going at full speed, you'll be fine. Right, so wait, which... hang on, where am I going? I thought I was going to Ark Corp mining area, but the thing is that there's one over here which is 229 kilometers away. And that's obviously on the surface, right? So if the mining area is 418 kilometers away, you know what's going to happen, right? We're going to fly into the planet before we get there. And it's all pitch black. I can't see jack shit. Uh... It's like hitting an asteroid in Elite Dangerous, but super much big. Yeah, well, I don't know. That's the other thing. If I crash into the surface of this planet, I just sort of ping off of it and it doesn't really matter. What? Yeah, it's happened loads of times. Sometimes the bottom of the ship explodes, but I've never died from it. Okay. I can't see nav points when I'm looking around. That's annoying. Right. At least it doesn't make dangerous. If you hit something going at high speed, you take damage. All there is here is an emergency shelter, so I'm annoyed now. Because th there's no way I'm going to actually land anywhere. Like, there's nowhere to land on this side of the planet, really. Not that I want to land on, anyway. So now what? Warp away and walk back and fly for another ten minutes in the same direction? Um, Probably. for... It says obstructed. What's that obstructed by? Obstructed by what, though? The atmosphere of the planet? There's literally nothing in front of that. Could be gravitational pull. Nah. I'm flying away from the planet at the moment and my altitude's going up. Um, Because there's no point landing in pitch darkness. The game does... No. The, the, the thing is, this game does darkness really well. But when I mean really well, I mean there's no light in the darkness. Which is good. But then you can't see well. anything. For you know, it's like huge swathes of the game. It just didn't, the, the, you know. The only time that you can have pure darkness is if there isn't an object behind it to have light reflect off of that. Hmm. And well, even just, then, there is some light to a degree. Well, I'm just going to chase the sunset for the moment because. I don't, there's literally no point in landing. I've tried landing it uh, when... Oh, 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 atmospheric... Atmospheric exit, maybe? I don't know. I'm just going to go up into space again so I can, like, land somewhere else because this is a really shitty place to land. Scheiser! Indeed. No, I just dropped my model. No! <laughs> did it yes! break? Did it break or did the glue hold? No, it didn't break, luckily. Whew. That's all right, mate. It's just a, it's just, it's just a, um, a battle, battle, just battle scarring, mate. It's a flesh wound. Yeah, it's just a little chip just off the armor, damage. mate. Yeah, yeah, battle damage, make it, make it look better. I was saying that to my kid the other day. I said, uh, you know, professionals when they finish painting their models, they'll actually go back and like file off stuff to make it look worn. So I'm like, don't worry about it, you know. <laughs> don't worry about it. Just paint it, and you'll get better. Uh. Because I'm not you amazing, watch, but... You should watch some of Adam Savage's model make that he does. Oh, the myth ba Mythbuster guy. Yeah. Dude, he does fantastic weather. Not he? just that, he's also an amazing cosplayer. Oh, yeah. yeah he often goes, like, low-key undercover, doesn't he? Yeah. yeah. He, uh... He made a entire spacesuit from... Alien Covenant, whatever that new Alien movie was. We're nearly at full speed. 
Come on, dudes, it, we can make it. made a lot of cool shit. 1,100 meters per second is where my ship caps out. Oh, wait, yeah, 1151, there we go. And then the engines just cap out, right. Oh, there we go. It looks pretty, I'm not gonna lie. It's a pretty game. Hey, Dom, if you install this on an SSD, it actually won't run like shit, mate. Are you sure, though? Yeah, I am sure, I'm sure. If you put it on an it, SSD, I, you'll I be okay. I've three or four SSDs, mate, you, you know? Should do, you, should, you should do it then, because basically that's why it ran so bad. It's because I had it on an SSD that had Windows on, yeah? And that's not good enough. So if you've got I an old... If, uh, if you... My Windows computer turned two of my SSDs into one SSD without me ask, asking me. I, I think that's why my SSD is screwed up, because I think Windows 10 did something funky to it. Yeah, it just, it just took over. I think it just took over, mate. It's probably mm -hmm. bridged an SSD and an HDD and nerfed the speed or something ridiculous. Right, yeah. I don't know what it's I done. I just have pure SSDs. See that planet down there? It looks gorgeous. Now we're in the light. Let's go down there. Oh, wait. No, actually, hang on. I might be able to get a decent wing, uh, a decent nav point. Oh, God. I think I just... I'm trying to kill my pilot by going as fast as I can and then doing high G turns. <laughs> like, seriously, the joystick is so sensitive. You know, like, all, it's like it goes from naught to 100 in about 5 millimeters of movement. It's crazy. Yeah. Like we, it's not. This isn't a dead zone thing. This is a sensitivity issue. Um, Elite Dangerous doesn't have that. It has quite a slack joystick. Um, right. All in good time, as they say. Don't know when that will be, but you know. The, okay. the source doesn't even have proper joystick control. Like, uh, can I actually use the joystick, or is it all keyboard and mouse? Okay, I've made it to Daymar, and this is me. That's me. So we've got an emergency shelter. And then, what's that? Arc Corp Mining is there. More emergency shelters. Let's go to the Arc Corp Mining. Arc Corp Mining. Settlement. Okay. Is that an enemy? That is actually a pirate. <laughs> okay, so where Red. am I? Ch Chaff deployed. Chaff oh. deployed. Where am I going though? Where's my bloody waypoint? Hang on. Shoe bin mining facility. Arc Corp mining facility. Do you think that's actually on this side of the planet though? Let's go find out. My God, 400. So yeah, it's going to be a few minutes till we get there. It's like I say, right? This game's good, but it's a game for patient people. It's not a game for the Twitch generation. Because like... Unless, of course, you are like playing with a bunch of people that own an area and you're in that area. Because like I'd say, travel, getting around and finding a place. It's like, ugh. Ugh. Oh. <clears throat> Tom, you should keep in mind that it is a space simulator. Here we go. We're going into what's it? We're doing re-entry, bruh. Re-entry? Here we did. We're doing it again, again. I want to do it again. Wait, doesn't that planet look way closer than it than it should be? It says 340 kilometers, but it looks like it's about 12 kilometers away. Look, objective failed. Locate pilot. Right, so I'm gonna slow down now because apparently it says I need to. So let's slow down. We have a lower, s no, we don't have a lower speed anymore. What's going on? Yeah. Yeah, we're losing altitude. We're gonna crash anyway, you ready? And I collided with the planet. Huh. Whee! Okay. Now that was a spectacular landing. That was... Do you know what, mate? I'm a pro. And, um... I bounced this high up in the air. Well, you could always turn into a basketball player. Right, why is my camera rotating while I'm turning? <laughs> <laughs> Threatened, you'll never get... <laughs> 
Way, I'm upside down now. Way, I'm not oh, the right no, way no. up now. What, the, what's going on now? I'm upside down. Well, clearly, the game wants you to play the game upside down. Yeah. So take a mind off. Oh, flip and it also, over and also, go. also, this place was supposed to be in. Uh, it was supposed to be in the uh, in light. And guess what? Sunset. <laughs> okay, so I've taken heavy damage to one thing. I don't wait, wait. But wait a second. So the sun's gone down now, but where's the thing I came to? Is that it? No. 200 kilometers away. I don't think so. What's my current altitude? 500 and falling. Right. Look, pitch darkness, mate. Uh, mining area is 300 kilometers away. So it's not even on this side of the planet. They really need to do some work on the nav point stuff, man. Because you can't tell which what's on what side of the planet. And you can't tell how far away the planet is when you're flying towards it. There's just nothing to tell you how far away it is. But right. it's an alpha. Is it, is it though? Right is it though? Is it really an alpha? 3.13, no. four years into development? Yeah, is it really an demo. alpha? Is it, a, is it though? I'm, look, I've made excuses for indie games being alpha, okay? But when you've got like a million pound budget. But, uh, sorry, 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 150 million pound alpha. budget. You can't rip into it at all. Yeah, it's immune from criticism because. No, no, it, it's a tech demo. It is legitimately a tech demo. Look, Nothing none of else. these. Alright, so none of these points. Are, are near me. None of them. Oh, you know, that yeah, sounds like ship uses fuel. Yeah, and I have I have actually used 50% of my fuel in finding nothing so far. Wait, so, and you've damaged your ship. Yeah. <laughs> well, I have You're a limit of... Nothing. I have a limit of how much time I spend on this game for a new patch. and Like, I wanted to check out some of the features of this new patch, yeah? But um, it's not going to happen, is it? Because by the way, does the joystick fly all right? Uh, yeah, it does, but it's super sensitive, and I had to switch roll and uh, yaw because roll and yaw were switched round for some weird oh, reason. Right. I've okay, never known anybody to do it that way. Right, so I'm there, and I need to be here. You set the destination, right? So you'd think there'd be like a. You know, a helpful indicator. Oh, fly no. this way. There's too many of them. <laughs> but it's not just that. Like, I don't know which one I've selected. We, you know, they're, they're either blue or red, right? Red means obstructed, so you can't get to it. All right, let's fly towards Shubin, shall we? There we go. Yeah, I can see it. It's all black here, so this must be space, right? Yeah. Yeah, no. yeah let's do it. Oh, that's a planet. Why is there a planet there? Landing successful. You just hit a rock. What? What the? F Did you just see what just happened? Right, I'm not mental. That was insane. I hit the planet. F face first at 500 meters per second. It hit the ground. Auto landed me. Then, so I'm now landing with my landing gear down, which, by the way, wasn't deployed. My ship has a vertical and a horizontal mode. So when I hit the ground, it glitched into horizontal mode, locked to the ground, bounced, and then flew at full speed into a rock. Yeah. <laughs> Check it out. I do not know that. That's Check it out. Normal. And it was like, you're in landing mode. <laughs> There's a snake in my boot. Um, okay. Level so it basically, off. this planet doesn't have atmosphere to slow you down. Well, it does. It's just that the atmosphere is like a jelly shield that makes a burning animation about two inches off the ground, and then you hit the ground. Well, it's not two inches, but it yeah. looks... T it doesn't... <laughs> it's Mars, mate. It doesn't... Well, it, it's, 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 it looks like two inches, you know? It's like space, 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 burny, 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 
atmosphere, 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 ground. Like you, yes. it's really hard to tell. It's the ground. <laughs> yeah, it's really hard to tell. And also, every time the gravity overtakes your acceleration, so like. Um, Bye, Papa. Yeah, whatever. I'm enjoying the game for its good parts, but it right. certainly has plenty of bad parts. And uh... is the space part good? <laughs> yeah, the space part's great. I enjoy getting out of the ship and doing, you know, like. In fact, because we're off the ground, I want to test something before I quit this game. All right. So our altitude is currently 2,000. So let's take it up to about 10. Millimeters? <laughs> well, yeah, exactly. Um, right, we'll take it up. So we're now doing full speed. Okay. No, we're not. We're not doing full speed yet. We should start to see fire. Upwards? Yeah. That, this is called a fact. God, I love this technique. Okay, a thousand is good. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to press F. Maximum space. Save and speed of I'm going to. And then you're coming gonna in. Open, 1, I'm going to. I'm going to open the oh, back no. door. I'm opening the back door. What? You're doing the spaceman? Why am I in the. Mate. Oh, yeah, that's right. Okay, this is going to be interesting. Oh, boy. We're doing a thousand. Oh, you're pulling a Kirk on us. <laughs> I need to get out. How do I get out? I can't get out <laughs> because the, the, the ship's transformed, so there's no way to get out. So I'm going to have to, unfortunately, press N, and then the, it's going to slow the ship down immediately. So come on, let me out! Let me out! <laughs> Your ship is burning. It doesn't let you out. <laughs> oxygen low. Look, oxygen low. Yeah. What's Pulling going on with my why, hand. mate? Why is my gun so high? I'm just going to jump out, mate. I've had enough. Goodbye, cruel world. Right, where's my ship then? Because it should keep flying. Oh, God. What the hell's going on here? Oxygen low, so... Are you falling yet? I don't know what's <laughs> happening, mate. My ship's gone, though. <laughs> yeah, it's the instance. <laughs> Did it? Probably. Yeah, ship's gone. Goodbye, ship. And the RCS Your is having a... Yet, you know. Look, my tank is running out of gas because... Oh, wait, no, I think I found Why a ship. Is... There's my ship. It's fighting gravity, mate. The, the, the RCS is fighting gravity. <laughs> uh, can, can you aim your nose up a few degrees? Oh, and my I God. Um... Because five minutes to live. Mate, I'm gonna quit before that happens. Look at it. I know. Look at it. It's making yeah. so much noise right now. RCS. RCS is just firing. And you're just having a pulse of 67. <laughs> yeah. I'm fo I'm chilled, mate. Right, any minute now, it's gonna run out of O2. I think that, isn't that jet fuel though? Yeah, there we go. And who had the idea of using your oxygen for RCS? Well, yeah, because look, my, my life has now gone down to 20 seconds. Look, it keeps on using up my oxygen. Yeah, <laughs> now I've got nothing. System ever in it. It's gone. <laughs> and that's the end. My ship's 468 meters away and I can't get to it. But then I did jump out of it. So now you should fall to the planet, don't you? Yeah, I bet, yeah, but I'll be a corpse. I am a meat popsicle. Right, I'm out. Thanks for watching. See you in a bit.